Hello, my name is Gandam Fanikumar. I am a faculty member with the Department of Metallurgical and Materials Engineering, IIT Madras. My area of research is in welding and solidification and it covers both experimental and computational aspects. In this online course on analysis and modeling of welding, I will be taking you through a set of lectures so that by the end you will gain insights into the different physical processes that take place during welding and also understand how these processes are modeled. We will start off with an introduction to different processes, uh, welding processes such as the arc welding processes, laser welding, electron beam welding, uh, plasma welding and so on. We will analyze these processes for their heat, tra heat transfer, the heat source modeling and uh, look at the heat transfer aspects in detail. We will come to the heat transfer by looking at the governing equations for heat transfer, the initial and boundary conditions, the analytical solutions that are available for simple geometries and numerical solutions by looking at an introduction to numerical solutions by solving these equations. We will also look at the effects due to phase change, effects due to fluid flow. We will look at the fluid flow in the weldment by looking at different driving forces for fluid flow and how they will affect the heat transfer within the weldment. We will also look at the composition evolution in the fusion weldment by looking at macro and micro segregation. We will also see how the micro segregation profiles will affect the microstructure evolution in the fusion weldment. We will then go to advanced aspects such as dissimilar welding and distortion in welding. We will understand how distortion can be controlled by modifying the thermal processes that take place during the welding and we will also understand dissimilar welding by looking at heat transfer and fluid flow during joining two metals that are having very different thermal properties. Towards the end we will see how an integrated approach can be taken to solve welding problems and uh, we will close by remarks on weld overlay and advanced aspects in welding. Towards the uh, end of this uh, course we will gain insights into how we can read a paper on modeling of weldments and we will be able to understand them in much more rigor than when we started off this course. I will expect you to go through a lot of reading outside of this course and I will be giving you pointers to the literature that you can read through. And if you attempt all the assignments regularly then you will be able to catch up with the progress of this course quite well. I will look forward to an engaging experience with you and hope that you will not only learn these concepts in depth but also be interested to take up further research in this domain. See you around.